Alan, who is uh, who is the chair of the of the history uh, history committee. Let's listen to first. Thank you all very much for coming. I'm very impressed with this uh, excellent turnout, considering this small room. What I first like to do is tell you a little bit about the goals and objectives of our committee, this being the first meeting of IEEE Silicon Valley Technology History. The committee was actually formed on a hike, or the, the idea came on a hike between, uh, with uh, myself and Ted Hopp, who is best known as co-inventor of the microprocessor, but played many other important roles at Intel. And we decided that we really need more emphasis on Silicon Valley developed technology, whereas the Computer History Museum will cover many areas of IT, but globally we want to zero in on the technologies that were created, that were progressed, advanced here in the greater Santa Clara County. <coughs> so our plan is to cover all such technologies, computers, storage, semiconductors, defense electronics, aerospace, industrial process controls, etc. Our goal is to hold one meeting every two months that's sponsored by our committee and we are in the process of getting funding to do exactly that. And in addition, we want to hold joint meetings with other nonprofits. Those nonprofits could be IEEE societies like IEEE Computer, IEEE Communication Society, uh, uh, could be Computer History Museum, it could be the, the Tech Museum, or any other nonprofit organization that had an interest <coughs> in Silicon Valley technology history. This is our uh, first meeting organized by Tom Coughlin. <coughs> And I want to thank him and uh, Tom Gardner for making this possible. They did a superhuman job of getting the venue, doing the logistics, and getting the panel members for this session. Our next planned meeting will be in the first quarter of 2014. We haven't set a date yet. It's all dependent on the venue. <coughs> and it'll be on local area networks. And this may be the first of a two-parter. For sure, it will, it will be covering Ethernet, Token Ring, and we hope data points, ArcNet. And if anyone is interested in volunteering to participate in the committee, please see me. We do have an operational website. We do have an internal email group. We are hoping to get an external email group as well to get the public involved. <coughs> so it's easy to remember, if you can, my name, alan.weisberger at IEEE.org.